I guess in Robert's absence, uh, um, I'll try to be brief. And uh, we basically achieved a lot of uh, our initial goals. We have uh, an ongoing, almost completed flow charts, and uh, we are preparing an area here to for the staging of the most practical uh, and I mean, it is yeah. well, I guess. Right. Last thing to, there is a new form going up, you know, it's how we're going to do it, what needs to be done when we do it. I know there's other instructions on how, what, what quantifies what we need to get done. Okay, so there's some of that stuff. Robert? Good morning. So we're working on one chart um, for weekly scrap reporting. It's going to be a daily chart. So we know how we're hitting our goal of our target for uh, cutting our scrap by 50% for the fourth quarter. Um, so the maximum amount of scrap that we want to see for the fourth quarter is 275,000, which is a lot, but it's a lot better than 550,000, which is what it was the last quarter. We're working on a, or almost finalizing a work instruction for inspector packers. It's going to talk about defects, scrap reporting, quality escalation, what they're supposed to do, um, what to look for defects, uh, how to report the defects, what to do with the defects, uh, so that each inspector packer knows what they have to do. There will be instructions at every press. Uh, that one will also do English and Spanish. We also want to make sure that we have red bins at every press. They'll be identified. We're going to do, we are finalizing work instructions on the mode status, uh, work instructions on material defects, and tomorrow we're going to start working on process defects and what to look for in the escalation, what to do once we have. Thank you. All right. So think about. So we got to make sure we 